got to be something extra hidden in here. Sure, let's just do the... Oh, I see a magazine there. Should have grabbed that. Imagine if your com computer looked like this, too. I hit open doors and it didn't do anything. Yes, there we go. Thank you. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hey, we got a game, too. Sweet. What's on your outfit? Crappy. Crappy outfit. Alright, so I think I got everything. Hey, I'm listening. Something up? Thoughts. Your thoughts? Wonder what Kellogg was up to before we dropped in on him. All Nothing right. else for now. Sure, sure. So let's get the hell out of here. Got what we needed. I'm surprised I have very little ammo for Kellogg's weapon, though. Again, something I gotta go back to Sanctuary and turn this shit in. Let's look, take a look at it. Not bad. It's not bad. I wonder if I could throw a silencer on this and just go to town. It's like a rainy day. Whenever I have some spare people to kill. I swear I seen movement there. How do I get out of this place? Back this way? Yeah, there we go. Take the elevator. Going we'll go back outside. See what happens. Oh, hey, there you are. I look down at my phone for one second, look back up, and you're right in front of me. Like a ghost, man. Please open up the door. I don't want to be stuck in here any longer. Oh, I could have just turned the turrets off. Psh. I'm not doing that. I'll do that whenever you can just kill them. Yeah, I'm never going in that again. Alright, so where are we going? Search for more information. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Do not interfere. Our intentions are peaceful. We are the Brotherhood of Steel. Shit. <laughs> Fuck, I can't believe. That wasn't selected on my quest, and I fucked that up. So, I'll be back. Deep into that darkness, I heard long as scared, wondering, fearing. Wow. That's so cool, though. Alright, I'll be back. Leave it to me to not pay attention to this one little thing here. <sighs> Notes. The boy Sean successfully delivered back to the Institute. The payment received. New orders to track down Renegade. Gathered reinforcements. Cleared out and secured Fort Hagen. We move out soon. That's all I had to look up. Where are you at, Valentine? Let's talk. I knew I fucked this up hey, somehow. Valentine. So, Kellogg wasn't giving us any bull. Your son really is on the inside. Even I don't know where the Institute is. And they built me. I need a way. There has to be a way, Nick. <sighs> We're in the weeds here. Time to take a step back. Bring in some fresh eyes. Only person I know willing to snoop up the Institute's tail feathers is Piper. The reporter in Diamond City. I say we head her way. Talk this through. All right, Diamond City it is. Hey, chin up. 
I know the night just got darker, but it won't last forever. All right, Let's see you back up on the surface. Going up. All right, so rather than go back to Diamond City, I want to take a stop at the police station real quick. Turn all this shit in. Talk to Paladin Dance, see what happens. Maybe he'll talk about the Brotherhood of Steel and the uh, big fucking blimp thingy that flew over me. I think it's called the Pride Win. I think that's what it's called. Been a while. Don't remember the name of it. Here's a beautiful workshop bench to look at in all its glory with a mini nuke on it. It's a stress beacon, it's a fat man. Yeah, I was just describing things. <laughs> So I didn't have to edit it out. Okay, let me talk to you real quick. Whoa. Okay. I thought I was gonna get hit by a missile. Alright, sound like someone crashed out there. Whoops. May have missed that. Talk to you in a second. Scribe. How's that search going? Were you able to find the artifact? Yep. Here it is. And still in good shape, too. Take this. The scribes are gonna love your find. I'll always want more tech, so believe. Report back to me when you're ready to head out. Mm -hmm. Sure. Affirmative. All right. Here's the location. Get on it. All right. There we go. Take that area is clear. Go fuck yourself. I hate you so much. Affirmative. Looks like I got my surprise for the day. Here. Your payment. Plenty more locations out there that need clearing. If you need time to regroup, take it. Once you're ready, let me know. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready. All right. Here's the data on the location. Don't come back until the op's done. Fine. Okay, let's talk to you now. Cavalry's and it looks like they sent in the big guns. That ship. I've never seen anything like it. Amazing, isn't it? We call our ship the Pridwin. She's loaded with enough troops and supplies to mount a major offensive. If she's here, Elder Maxon's here. And that means we're going to war. Gonna be a quick war with that thing on our side. Yeah, but for who? That's the plan. If history's proven anything, it's that an overwhelming show of force has a chance of halting a conflict before it begins. That being said, you're about to get to know the Pridwin up close and personal. I've received orders that we're both to report to her immediately. Sweet. Follow me up to the roof of the police station. We're going for a little ride. Let's do that then. Human-looking synths are the worst. They hide in plain sight. Are you a synth? I am feral. Radiation has a twisted sense of humor. Can you believe synths are replacing humans with exact duplicates? Yes. Yes, I can. Let me go through that door first. Oh, you bastard. Oh, wait, no, I got it. <laughs> Every time I see this screen now where it's just black with the little green thing on the bottom, it scares me now. I think it's going to get stuck. Alright, well, I'm here. Take me on the ride. Bus, blow up the bus. I want to blow something up. Shit, I should have got that military frequency. It's a really nice view though. Everyone down there believed in our cause. But they've been blinded by rumors and 
Am I getting shot at? They don't realize that the Brotherhood of Steel is the Commonwealth's last hope for survival. Every man, woman, and child below is in mortal danger. If we fail, it's only a matter of time before the enemy overwhelms the population. Cleansing the Commonwealth is our duty, and I will gladly spill my own blood if it ensures our victory. I just want to blow something up. Hey, there's the boat. I'm gonna visit them and turn that thing in and install that. I don't know where they think they're going <laughs> once I get the, everything back up and running, but hey, that's not my problem. Blow it up, blow it up. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Probably already mad at me. I hope nobody was near that, because I'm fucked if they are. <laughs> Have to reload a save. At least we're almost there. Then we have so many quests to pick up there as well. It's been far too long since I've been aboard. All right, soldier. This is the moment when everything changes. I hope you're ready. I had the game glitch on me here before, which is really annoying. It was something whenever I had to get on there, one of the vertebrates go down to the ground, and then I don't know, go to some sort of like testing site or some shit. It's really annoying. Since I'd like to show everybody what's going on here, I really would like to uh, get a. Whoops. Really like to get a thumbnail going here. I think like that would be good. Angle like that. Yeah, there we go. Alright. Just wanted to try it. We'll see how that works. Permission to come aboard, sir? Permission granted. Welcome back, Captain. Allow me to be the first to congratulate you on a successful mission. And is this our new recruit? Yes, sir. I feel promoted him to initiate, and I'd like to sponsor his entry into our rankings personally. Yes, we've read your reports. Oh, You'll be pleased well, to know that Elder Max has approved too. your request. Place the recruit in your charge. Thank you, sir. And my current orders? You are to remain on the Privet and await further instructions. Very good, sir. Ad Victorium, Captain. Ad Victorium, Captain. All right. Whoa. You okay there? <laughs> so, you're the one Paladin Dance has taken under his wing. You don't look much like a soldier to me. Looks are deceiving. Looks can be deceiving. Which is precisely why I personally insist on scrutinizing every recruit who boards this vessel. I've read Paladin Dance's reports. He seems to think you'll make a fine addition to the Brotherhood. You might expect an endorsement like that to grant you a great deal of latitude with us. But let me make one thing clear. The Brotherhood of Steel has traveled to the Commonwealth with a specific goal in mind. As the captain of this vessel, I won't allow anyone to jeopardize our mission, no matter how valuable they think they are. Understood? Sure. Absolutely. Good. That's all for now, soldier. Your orders are to proceed to the command deck for the address. After which, Elder Maxon wishes to have a word with you. If you have any questions, ask me now. Otherwise, you're dismissed. Don't have shit to ask you. I don't have any questions. Then I suggest you head over to the command. Dismissed, initiate. Alright, I will in a second, but I just want to see what's over here at the end. What you got up here? 
Yeah, well, I can take freely. I will gladly do that. Yep, looks like we're taking all that. What is that? Cool. Taking that, for sure. I'll have to store that in my sanctuary. And, yeah. I'll have to store everything there, store all the junk. I have to... I, that's the only thing I don't like, is I have to go back and forth. I wish I could, like, set up, like, a... The road behind has been Robin to take it back. Fraught with difficulty. Each and every one of you has surpassed my expectations by rapidly facilitating our arrival in the Commonwealth. You have accomplished this amazing feat without a hint of purpose or direction. And most impressively, without question. Now that the ship is in position, it is time to reveal our purpose and our mission. Beneath the Commonwealth, there is a cancer known as the Institute. A malignant growth that needs to be cut before it infects the surface. They are experimenting with dangerous technologies that could prove to be the world's undoing for the second time in recent history. The Institute scientists have created a weapon that transcends the destructive nature of the atom bomb they call their creation, the Sith. A robotic abomination of technology that is free-thinking and masquerades as a human being this notion that a machine could be granted free will is not only offensive, but horribly dangerous. And like the atom, if it isn't harnessed properly, it has the potential of rendering us extinct as a species. I am not prepared to allow the Institute to continue this line of experimentation. Therefore, the Institute and their Sixth are considered enemies of the Brotherhood of Steel and should be dealt with swiftly and mercilessly. This campaign will be costly, and many lives will be lost. But in the end, we will be saving humankind from its worst enemy, itself. Ad Victorium! Ad Victorium! Ad Victorium! I prefer laser weapons myself. It's a cleaner shot. All right, let's talk to him. Ozone smell behind. I care about them, you know. The people of the Commonwealth. Let's say... Oh, I mean, I want to say you don't care, because it's obvious. I can see that. They're playing with fire, and we need to save them. Exactly. I just hope we're here in time. I refuse to allow the mistakes of the past to be repeated. Don't worry. I'm convinced. Paladin Dance's reports were quite clear regarding your feelings toward the Brotherhood. And he concludes that you'd be an asset to us, seeing as he's one of my most respected field officers. You couldn't get a better recommendation. Therefore, from this moment forward, I'm granting you the rank of knight. Whoa. And, befitting your title, we're granting you a suit of power armor to protect you on the field of battle. Wear it with pride. Woohoo. Certainly won't be wearing that. Best to live up to it. I'm certain that you will. In any event, once you're finished becoming familiar with the Pridwin and my staff, report to the flight deck for your new orders. Welcome aboard the Pridwin, soldier. Make us proud. All right, let's start talking to everybody. Get some quests going here. <laughs>